Today's medical-centric topic is Myelodysplastic Syndromes, MDS, Understanding Symptoms, Causes, and Treatment. Myelodysplastic Syndromes, MDS, are a group of disorders caused by poorly formed or dysfunctional blood cells. These syndromes can lead to various health issues and understanding their symptoms, causes, and treatment options is crucial for effective management. Causes of Myelodysplastic Syndromes MDS occurs when the bone marrow produces abnormal blood cells. Key factors include 1. Genetic mutations Changes in the DNA of bone marrow cells can lead to MDS. 2. Previous cancer treatments Chemotherapy and radiation therapy can increase the risk of developing MDS. 3. Environmental exposures. Exposure to certain chemicals, such as benzene, may raise the risk. 4. Age. The risk of MDS increases with age, particularly after 60. 5. Genetic disorders. Conditions like Down syndrome may predispose individuals to MDS. Symptoms of Myelodysplastic Syndromes. Symptoms vary depending on the type and severity of MDS, but commonly include 1. Fatigue Persistent tiredness and weakness due to anemia 2. Shortness of breath Difficulty breathing, especially during physical activity 3. Unusual bleeding or bruising Easy bruising, frequent nosebleeds, or bleeding gums 4. Frequent infections Reduced white blood cells lead to a higher risk of infections. 5. Pale skin. Paleness or pallor due to anemia. Risks associated with myelodysplastic syndromes. Several factors increase the risk of MDS, including 1. Age. MDS is more common in older adults. 2. Previous cancer treatment. Prior chemotherapy or radiation therapy can increase the risk. 3. Chemical exposure. Exposure to industrial chemicals like benzene. 4. Smoking. Tobacco use is linked to a higher risk of MDS. 5. Genetic predisposition. Family members of MDS or other blood disorders. Diagnosis. Diagnosis involves a combination of clinical evaluations and tests. Blood tests. Complete blood count, CBC, to measure levels of red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. Bone marrow biopsy. Examination of bone marrow samples to identify abnormal cells. Cytogenic analysis. Studying the chromosomes of bone marrow cells for abnormalities. Flow cytometry. Analyzing the characteristics of blood and bone marrow cells. Treatment options. 1. Supportive care. Blood transfusions. To maintain anemia and low blood cell counts. Growth factors. Medications to stimulate bone marrow to produce more blood cells. 2. Medications. Immunosuppressive therapy. Drugs to suppress the immune system and improve blood counts. Hypomethylating agents. Medications that help restore normal function to bone marrow cells. 3. Stem cell transplant. A potential cure for some patients involving the replacement of diseased bone marrow with healthy donor cells. 4. Clinical trials. Participation in trials for new treatments and therapies. Prevention and management. Regular monitoring. Frequent blood tests and checkups to monitor blood cell levels and overall health. Healthy lifestyle. Balanced diet, regular exercise, and avoiding smoking. Avoiding chemical exposure. Limiting exposure to known carcinogens like benzene.
Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.